Welcome to The Know, I'm Ashley Jenkins, and researchers at the University of Rochester have made a new breakthrough in cloaking technology that not only uses inexpensive and readily available materials, but overcomes some of the issues previous attempts have dealt with. However, it's not quite to the level of invisibility cloaks just yet. Previous cloaking solutions typically focus on hiding something from a straight on view, but require exotic materials and don't really hold up if the object moves, or if the viewer does, as the shift in perspective causes the background to distort or move dramatically. Rochester's researchers use a combination of four standard lenses instead, which offers up to 15 degrees of flexibility without exposing the cloaked item. Joseph Choi, a PhD student at Rochester's Institute of Optics who's working with Professor John Howell on the project, says, This is the first device that we know of that can do three-dimensional, continuously multi-directional cloaking, which works for transmitting rays in the visible spectrum. The way this new cloaking technology works, as opposed to the old and busted technology, it requires four specific lenses placed a precise distance apart, but it can be scaled up as large as the lenses. And though this method makes more of a donut-shaped cloak, meaning the middle isn't entirely disguised, that problem is solved with a slightly more complex version, and larger lenses reduce the effect of the edge, too. The team currently speculates that applications for this solution could range from medical, like letting a surgeon see through his hands as he's operating, to convenience, like turning blind spots in cars into windows instead. The team has even provided a formula to create your own patch of invisibility, as well as advice on lenses to use. We'll leave a link in the description in case you want to try it out. So, what do you think of this new breakthrough? Brilliant or will you not be satisfied until you can take invisibility on the road with you? Let us know in the comments. Remember, you get the best news in video games, entertainment, and super cool tech and science right here. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel and we'll keep you in the know.